NFC Championship game, guys. This is what we've been working for all year. Now, I gotta be honest, I am a little nervous about this one. AD99 can wreck any game at any point. They also have a pretty good corner in Jalen Ramsey, and their strengths match our weaknesses. But guys, we gotta win. That's the only goal of the week. And without further ado, the NFC Championship game is underway. Oh boy, here we go. Matt Stafford... Cooper Cup and the gang versus Kirk Cousins. Head coach Sean McVay gets to go against his former assistant in Kevin O'Connell for a trip to the Super Bowl on the line. And guys, we're underway and Greg Joseph will start the 2022 NFC Championship game off with a touchback. You know, last week, if there was ever anything, it was, you know, look, just make Justin Fields beat us through the air. But it's not as simple uh, this week as it was last. We do not want to get beat by Cooper Cup. So we are going to be spotlighting Cooper Cup on pretty much every play. There is one player we do not want to get beat by. And it's right there. Right there. And that's... Kendrick's almost at him. But 20-yard gain right to Cooper Cup right from the start. We are, I mean, we were, we were that close to having a pick to start the day. Instead, it's a 20-yard game. It's fine. Running a little double A gap here. Pick! Pick! Pat Pete! What a start to the game! Pat Pete! Can Allen Robinson or Cooper Cup catch him? He's inside the 10, inside the 5! What a start! What a start! Oh my goodness, what a start to the NFC Championship game. That is... Let's go. Seven nothing ball game. Truly, what a start to the NFC Championship game. I mean, we know Matt Stafford throws a decent amount of interceptions, but I don't think anybody had that envision to this game. Um, we had two pick sixes last week with uh, with Justin Fields throwing a couple of turnovers, but. Or throwing a couple of interceptions, but truly, what a, just what a start, man. Oh, and Stafford sacked. What a play. Holy cow, I was not expecting that. Phylon on the sack. I mean, he beat his man on the previous play, but, I mean, guys, this has been everything and then some. And like I said, we are spotting, we are spotlighting Cooper Cup every single play. Like, we do not want to get beat by Cooper Cup. That rush up the middle. Oh, man, Cooper Cup, good play right there. I will say the Rams left guard and center is not good. I mean, I know they're they're not great in real life, but I've been just usering Dalvin Tomlinson and our other guy Phylon, but it is like they are just getting beat handedly every every time. So this is definitely gonna Oh no, no, no. Harry, get him, get him. Harry! Harry! Come on. Twenty seven yards. Oh boy. Alright, we want to we're gonna oh no 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 we're gonna back out we're gonna back out we're gonna we're gonna play a little man we're gonna play a little man and we are spotlighting Cooper Cup of course and I'm just sending more heat up the middle. I mean Alright, there we go. A little oh, gain of eight. I thought that was more of a gain of four or five. Um, but now the Rams have the ball in our red zone. So we need we need to make a stop here. And Cam Akers gets the first down. So two carries, 30 yards on the day. Still spotlighting Cooper Cup every single play. Right there. And, oh, I thought Pat Pete had another one. I was using Eric Kendricks to drop back and cover. I, I don't know which. It might have been the receiver. I don't know if it was the tight end. But And then I realized the pass rush was getting there. But second and 10. Here we go. Here we go. Need that play. Oh, my God. He just struck Pat Pete. Okay. Holy cow. Van Jefferson just absolutely demolished Pat Pete. We're going balls to the wall here. We have... We're going on a blitz here. We need. We just need to stop. Free man. Free man. Touchdown. That happens. We were down inside the 10. Those plays are going to happen. Um, Kendricks was starting to get to Stafford.
Personal foul roughing the kicker penalty. All right, so all that's going to be is we're going to get the ball at the 25. All right, so Kirk Cousins takes the field in the NFC Championship game with a tie game. I think Kirk would uh, very much take that. Now, like I said, we are going to be we're going to be focused on 99 all day. That's going to be the guy. Good run by Dalvin, really good run by Dalvin, and that is 19 yards to start the day. And there was a play last week that we called multiple times and we're going to get to it today. The play action leak, we love calling that. Uh and on a play action play under center we're without a doubt double teaming 99. Without a doubt, double teaming 99. Oh no 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 no. Shoo. I wanted I wanted Kirk to lead Reger a little more up the field. Um, but we'll take a gain of 17 in any way. I thought for sure though that that was going to be a pick. I thought the thought the corner was going to undercut that. Two plays, two first downs for the Minnesota Vikings. You'd love to see that, and will it be three? I'm going to say probably not. You never know. Uh, but Dalvin picks up seven. Now it is time to bring in number two, Alexander Madison. Love what Alex has done the whole season. And uh, Dalvin, three straight plays. We're going to bring in the big boy now, and Alex gets us close to a first down. He gets us two yards up to the 30. And one thing that I've that I've kind of preached all year that I love doing is bringing, and this was earlier in the year, but I love bringing Alex in so that Dalvin can be at like you know more stamina later in the drive. Good run, Dalvin. Well, not a great run, but a, oh, he didn't even get the first down. Well, guys, we uh, I'll just put it like this: we didn't come this far to come this far, so we're we're going for it, and uh, we're giving the ball to number four. Dalvin has a a large contract for a reason, and we're putting the ball in his hands. And he more than pays it. There we go. All right. I thought Dalvin got the first down of that third down, though. But we'll take we'll take a first down any way we can. We'll take a first down. And we are, I mean, knock on wood, guys, but we are moving the ball right along. Ah, good play by Bobby Wagner. He's still he's still a beast. I mean, he's still 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 a good player. Second and sixteen, effectively a sack. But we'll see how we rebound from that. Where do they have Jalen? Okay, so Jalen's out there on the left side. Second and 16. And they don't they don't even have Jalen on JJ. And JJ's going to get... What? I'm so, Hold on, I'm going to take a replay at that. I thought JJ had his, had both feet in. And they would, they would be replaying this in real life. Okay, so there's... Hold on. One, two... Oh my goodness, in the transition, he didn't get the... Am I missing something? Hold on, hold on. One, clearly. And then they're they're going to say that that's not in. Uh, I'm not even going to waste a challenge because we're going to get this third down. Not ideal. Not ideal. But third and 16. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Right there. Irv, what a play! What a play! Kirk absolutely threaded the needle. Had to get it... Had to drop it above the linebacker. What a play. And Irv, you have most definitely earned a well-deserved rest here on this play. I mean, that was clutch. That was a hell of a play all around. Let's feed the ball to four. Dalvin, 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 get in. Are we in? Down to the one. No huddle, no huddle, no huddle. They are, they are gassed. I know I know they're gassed at this point. And now we walk in. Good play. That's what I'm talking about. Hit, I, want, I want the team in the end zone celebrating. We've made it this far as a team. All right, there we go. Okay. CJ, Ezra, Dalvin. That's what I'm talking about. What a drive. You know, the Rams have a big touchdown drive. We answer. And we're up 14-7. And that was an 11-play drive. That's what I'm talking about. Great drive for Kevin O'Connell's Vikings to counter Sean McVay's Rams. And let's see if we can bait Stafford into another pick six. I'd really love to bait Matt Stafford into another interception or just a hurried throw, you know, anything. Oh boy, not that. Just not anything but that. And Cam Akers doesn't go down on initial contact and it's a 21-yard run. <clears throat> so the run defense, you know, we're kind of selling out to uh, 
kind of selling out to stop stop the uh the aerial attack but even that right there just a little six yard gain i mean that was right underneath all right we're coming in with some heat here oh no they had three tight ends on the field i wanted to send heat all right here we go we're gonna spotlight where is he cooper cup is in the backfield okay all right we have kendricks on cooper cup don't love that good play pat pete early breakup now we have third and four third and four Oh, man, I just, like, guys, if we can get off the field, I'm going to audible into a cover three. I do not want, come on, guys, let's get off the field here. I did not want Harrison Smith covering a cover two zone. No, no, he got me right there. Hell of a play. Hell of a route by Van Jefferson. Watch it on the screen. It was like a little stop and keep going, and it was, watch when it pulls up. Yeah, right there, the red route, I, I'm pointing at it, but that's a hell of a route. He definitely got me, so credit where it's due, credit where it's due. I wanted to get off the field there. See if we can stop a run. Can we stop a run? No, no. No, Stafford gets out of it. No. I was going for the strip there because Kendrick's had a free run, but an incomplete pass, it's fine. I definitely thought it was going to be a run, and then once I was that committed, I was just like, well, let's just let's just take this the full way here. Good play, Andrew Booth. Way to tackle. Way to open field tackle there. Now we have third and six from the 20. All right, guys, this is... This is critical. If we can get off the field here. Just if we can get off the field. Right there. Oh, Andrew, I thought he had a pick. That might have, you know what? Didn't happen, but that was so close. That was very close. Can we block a field goal? No. And it is down the middle. It's a 14-10 game. That was so close. I mean, Andrew Booth read it. And uh, that was just inches away from being a pick. And let me tell you, fellas, inches are a big deal. Inches are a very big deal. Anyway, we're going to get the ball at the 25-yard line. All right, here we go. We're going to run a little play action to start the drive. I was glad with how the defense did not break there, by the way. C.J. Ham on the play. C.J. Ham for a first down. What a play. C.J., great route. I want to see if it'll come up. Oh, I was hoping it would take, like, no, with the play calling not in the way. But great route there by CJ. Little zig route. Defense didn't know it hit him. Also a great throw by Kirk on the run. There's a good play by Dalvin, and Dalvin is going to get us seven more yards. Okay, so I got to be honest. I, I was very, very worried about... Uh, you know, the, the Rams run defense coming in, and not to say that, you know, we've figured it out or that we've mastered it or anything like that, because we haven't, at least not yet. But I, I like with what we're doing so far. But there's another, that's a first down run. Another first down run. You love to see that. Alex Madison, two carries, seven yards on the day. Now, I kind of want to go play action here. All right, so Irv is in on the, I'm actually going to, ooh, I'm actually going to reset this play because I, I do want Irv to go. I'm actually just going to have Irv stay in. It's just, it's just going to be a three-man route concept. And there's Jalen Rager right there. Just catch it. Oh, I wanted Jalen just to just to bring it in, but that was a tough play. I thought we had him. It was a it was a levels play where I thought the, the safety was taking the underneath with Thielen, so I thought Rager was right there at the second level, but other DB came up and made a play. More credit to him. There's a good play by Kirk under pressure, and there's a really good catch and run by Adam Thielen, and we are down to the Rams' 28-yard line. I mean, guys, the past, like, couple weeks, we've been doing a tremendous job doing, not doing, we've been doing a tremendous job of balancing the offense, you know, both run, go on, Johnny, Johnny Munt, what a play, 14 more. Uh, balancing with run, play action, calling plays from the shotgun, calling plays under center. It's kept defenses extremely ex just off balance, man. I mean, they don't know what's coming. And here we go. Here we go. There's Jalen Reger right there. If Dalvin picks up that block, he's in and he's in. Jalen Reger, playoff touchdown. Hit your signature, Jalen. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I mean, that's what I mean, guys. We have been playing and clicking on all cylinders. And that drive right there, I'm thinking it was eight plays. What was it? 
Seven plays, 75 yards. I mean, a play to C.J. Ham, a play to Johnny Munt. Alex Madison had a couple carries. I mean, we're, we're killing it. We have two drives, two 75-yard touchdowns. Love what we're seeing. Love what we're seeing from the offense, and they're going to get the ball at the 25. We are coming out here in the double A gap. <clears throat> Let's see if we can get Zedarius Smith going. He has not been going much at all this year, but see if we can get it going here. Oh, we got pressure. We got pressure, and Cam Dantzler breaks up the play. That was out on Cam Akers, by the way. Love what we had going there. Love, we, we were bringing pressure. I'm going to see if I can actually hit Cooper Cup at the line of scrimmage with Daniil. Oh, no, don't need to. Oh, Daniil, Daniil just missed the play. It's a third and six. All right, so much better, much better pass defense than what we've seen so far. I'll say that. Or run defense, excuse me. All right, third and six. Oh boy, no pressure at all. Guys, guys, guys! Let's go, Harrison Smith. What a play. Alright, we're off the field. Now this, guys, this could be a big game changer. I mean, they've came in and ran the ball, or excuse me, they've thrown the ball on 80% of their plays. I don't get that. 16 plays, 4 runs. Oh my goodness. Can A Wong Woo? Can he? Okay, no, that's fine. We're just trying to cut it back to go down the sideline. That's fine. I'm serious with what I said, though. I mean, we have been playing, we've been doing a great job of keeping everybody off balance. Nobody knows what's coming. And Kirk, by the way, he's been dealing. To Thielen. That was definitely a forced one, but look, we'll take it. And we are in Rams territory. Kirk, 9 for 11, 119 yards and a touchdown on the day. Not quite at half, but Kirk's having himself a day. All right, let's go here. We have 48 rushing yards looking to add looking to add to that this play here. Ah, nowhere to go, nowhere to go. And Dalvin picks up two. Okay, so it could have been could have been worse. Could have been worse. We're gonna run our patented tight Y off play and see if we can get anything from this. Alright, let's go here, guys. Second and eight on the Rams 43. See if we can get anything. Throw it away, throw it away. Nobody there, nobody there. That's fine. But the big thing there is we didn't take a sack to get us out of. I mean, we're not quite in field goal range, so we do need uh, we need at least uh, like five or six yards here. All right, we need at least five or six. See if see what we can do. JJ, JJ, I'm going on the in route. JJ just picked off. No, it's not. JJ comes down with it. 29 yards. Kirk going for the big ball. And he got it. And that's Justin Jefferson's first catch in this NFC Championship game. And we are down to the Rams 14 yard line. I got to be honest here, guys. I'm going to try and call Dalvin on a slant and see if we can get JJ one on one for a jump ball in the end zone. No, we cannot. We cannot. Oh, there's nowhere to go. Yeah, sack. Nowhere. I was definitely locked on JJ a little longer than I would have liked to admit. Um, Yeah, not, not a good play on my part. Really not a good play on my part. And uh, paid for it. But it could have been worse. It could have been, it could have been a turnover. And now we're at third and nineteen. I'm not gonna force anything here. Um, it's looking like we're gonna have an open middle of the field, a mofo concept. Cover two is what it's looking like. Oh boy, just please pick that up. Okay, shoo. I was trying to get it up to Thielen, and we get a strip sack. I'm not sure who was credited for that, but look. We'll just take the points and we'll go up 24-10. Greg Joseph, perfect all year. I know I shouldn't be saying that in uh, Viking NFC Championship games, but we're up 24-10. That's fine. We're up 24-10. Everything's looking good. We still, we are, by the way, if you guys were wondering, we are still very much spotlighting Cooper Cup every single play. Any, but we don't want Cooper Cup to beat us. I mean, we, we, it's, it's simple here. I mean, I know it's, Probably not the smartest sounding, but we'll take that play to Tyler Higby over getting beat by Cooper Cup. Like, we just, we do not want to get beat by Cooper Cup. Oh, we just went for the pick there, didn't get it. That's fine. That's fine, Dantzler, because if Dantzler, if Dantzler would pick that off, that would have been a 31-10 game. He knew he had a safety back there. I, believe it or not, am completely fine with him giving up those yards on that specific play. He had a, he had deep help. 
and Harrison Smith brought him down. There's a false start on Rob having seen the right tackle, and that'll push him back five. All right, there we go. Defense, let's dig in here. Got to be honest, I'm half tempted. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to bring in, as crazy as this sounds, I'm going to bring in Ross Blacklock at right end here. But, I mean, we haven't seen much from Zedarius uh, all year. He had like four sacks all year. So we're going to bring in Ross Blacklock. And Ross bringing pressure on the first play. Granted, Stafford kind of flushed to his side, but look, we'll take it. Of course, we're still spotlighting Cooper Cup every play. That's not going to change. Second and 15. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Let's go. Broken up. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm freaking talking about, guys. Third and 15. We're sending a little heat here, by the way. We are sending some heat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. They're, they're going to get a field goal out of it. That's fine. We're going to take a timeout, and we want to get our... Offense back on the field, and even a 50-yarder is not guaranteed. So we're – this is not a guarantee. This is not a gimme for Matt Gay. This isn't – come on, come on, miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it. It doesn't have the distance, man. Okay, it had the distance. I was like, holy cow. I mean, that was a short kick. Oh, boy. All right. 24-13 game, and we get the ball with about a minute to play. With two timeouts. Man, if we can make it a 31-13 game, it's gonna we're going to get the ball at the 25. If we can make it a 31-13 game, ooh, I like our chances, and I'm just going to leave it at that. All right, fellas, here we go. This is what we've been working for uh, all year. All year. There's a great play to Thielen to start. There we go. All right, no huddle, no huddle. No huddle, pretty simple. Let's keep it going. Let's feed JJ. I want to get JJ the football, man. I want to get JJ the football, but I'm also not stupid in terms of like just force feeding him just because he is Justin Jefferson. Uh, now we're going to take a timeout. All right. Two plays and we have the ball at the Rams 38. JJ has two catches for 40 yards in the first half. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to call Jalen Reger on a slant because I want to wear J. I want to wear Jalen Ramsey's ass out. Thielen, another play down the middle. We're going to take the timeout at the end of this play here. Timeout, 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 timeout. Okay, we have the ball. 25 seconds, no timeout at the Rams 16-yard line. Okay. I like, believe it or not, I like where we are. All right, here we go. Kirk Cousins over 200 passing yards in the first half. Kirk Cousins going for it all. Thielen knocked out. Kind of want to call a screenplay just because it would, oh man, it would catch them off guard. It would, like, there is no shot that they'd be preparing for a screenplay in this situation. We're not going to call a screenplay, though. All right, let's go here. JJ! Oh, no, that's picked. That was picked. Yep. That was, I wanted it to be a lob. It wasn't a lob. Wanted it to be more towards the back pylon. Good play by Troy Hill. And that's, uh,. That's Kirk's first interception in a very long time. I don't know how long, but it, it's been weeks since Kirk threw an interception. So, uh, it is what it is. That'll take us to half. I mean, we're still up double digits, so it's not the end of the world that Kirk threw a first-half interception. It is what it is. Rather, first half than fourth quarter. So, we're going to the half in the NFC Championship game up 24-13. Life could be a hell of a lot worse. Kane Wangwu is going to field the ball at the goal line, take it up, and he is going to be brought down at the 27-yard line. Okay, so not a great end to the first half. Um, like I said, like I said before we went in the half, we're up double digits. Um, it could be a lot, lot worse. So, good run by Dalvin, really good run by Dalvin, and that will get us out to the 37. Now we have second and one. A lot of options to go here. I'm going to, I'm going to give the ball, I'm going to give the rock to Dalvin again. I just want to get a first down. I don't want to take too many chances on the, on this play. There we go. Really good run by Dalvin. He's having a great game. And uh, we're out to the 44. Little screen play, screen play to Dalvin. Oh, I don't like that. And it was better that that was incomplete anyway. Okay, so Kirk now 13 of 20 on the day. Uh, still having a solid game, all things considered. We are going to give Dalvin uh, a breather here. Three straight plays, three straight times the ball went to him out of the half. 
Um, but we are out to our 44-yard line. So a lot, lot of positives so far here in the second half. And Alexander Madison gets us, what is that, nine? He gets us nine big ones on second and ten. And we're going we're gonna to give the ball right back to Alex. We're going to give it right back to him. We believe in him. Ball on the Rams, 47-yard line. And Alex will push the pile. Good run by Alex Madison. And that is a big first down here in the third quarter. Big, big first down in the third quarter. Takes more time off the clock. Gives us an even longer drive. I like what we have going on. Dalvin back in the game, refreshed after a couple play. Breather, JJ, there he is. And ball was knocked out. Wow. Not used to seeing that uh, from JJ. So definitely should have possession catch it. That's more on me than, uh, than Jefferson. That's just a frustrating, not drop, because it was a good play. Here we go. J oh, no, 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 no. Whew. I wanted to go to JJ again. Didn't get it. Rams brought heat and uh, had to get the ball out quick. I thought the DB was going to reach up and snag that one, though. Thank goodness he did not. Um, let's go here. Third and 10 from the Rams, 35. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. There's Thielen. Can we get the first? It's going to be tight, and Thielen gets the first down. An 11-yard pickup. That is the type of play that breaks teams' wills. You know, you have them third and 10. Uh, you're about to get off the field on what's already been a long drive. A relatively long drive. And they, they pick it up. I got to be honest, um, as much shit as I gave Ezra Cleveland early in the year about, you know, he needs to pick up blocks better and, you know, things of that nature. I hate to say it, but I'm going to say it. He's done a good job with AD99 today. He's done a really good job. He's not an easy assignment, and he's done a uh, he's done a wonderful job. Good play by Dalvin, and we are out to the Rams 27. I want to call a play action here, play in the worst way, man. I really, really do. I really, really do. Oh, play action leak. Kind of want to audible out of it. I'm, I'm nervous for this play. I'm very nervous for this play. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's why I'm nervous. And it's a sack. And Leonard Floyd gets in the backfield. I really don't know what Irv Smith was doing there. Or Brian O'Neill, I guess. Um, but now we have a 53-yard attempt for Greg Joseph. Greg Joseph, snap, hold, kick is down the middle, and we're up 27-13. Definitely would have liked to have got a touchdown on that drive. There's no, no denying that, um, but we'll take points any way we can get it. You know, we come out, of the, come out of the break, and we have a drive that almost takes half the third quarter. We'll take it. And like I said, we're up two touchdowns, so I'm not going to dwell on the fact, you know, oh man, it'd be nice to be up three scores right now if Kirk didn't throw that pick before half. We're not going to dwell on that. We are That is one thing we are not going to do all second half, is just dwell, dwell, dwell. Cam Dantzler picks it! Oh, he, oh, no he didn't, no he didn't, no he didn't, he broke it up. Oh, I thought he, I thought, oh man, I was like, holy cow, like what a start to the second half. But Alright, here we go, here we go. Second and ten. Man, there's nobody, nobody, nobody. Oh, no, no, no. Is that a... What a snag by Allen Robinson. Andrew Booth just... Andrew Booth just got took to school. It could have... You know, he could have been taken to school by, um, but it's going to happen. It's going to happen. You know, I mean, you're playing the, one of the best teams in the league. There's a reason that they are in the NFC Championship game with us, and I'll leave it at that. All right, we're sending heat here. I mean, guys, like, we, we want to get off the field here. Like, we want to get off the field. Oh, boy, I don't like this. That's why I don't like that. That might be a touchdown. And it is a touchdown. Didn't like how that started. Didn't like the way it looked. We sent Heat. Didn't get any sort of pressure at all. And it's going to be a 27-20 to game when Matt Gay makes his extra point. Okay, so they answered in a big way. Four plays, 74 yards. Not nervous time by any means, but it's uh we gotta execute here on this drive. We I mean we we have to execute on this drive. And that's all there is to it. Yards are about the same on the day, two eighty five to two seventy nine in favor of the Vikings. Um but now I'm a little more in favor of the Vikings, but second and seven is what we're gonna have from the Rams twenty eight. Um but look, we gotta get points here. 
You know, we, we, the absolute truly worst thing that could happen on this drive is if we go three and out. So let's, uh, let's not do that. And we are going to have the ball third and three at the 32. What is Kevin O'Connell going to dial up? All right, here we go. We've ran 40 offensive plays today. We've, uh, We've been playing, I would say we've been playing good football today. Little last second audibles from Kirk at the line. Here we go. Big play. Really big play. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Justin Jefferson bails us out. Oh, boy. Go to O Reliable when you need him. 1-8. The franchise hit the signature. Oh, man, was I nervous for that one. All right. Let's go. We're going to bring, now we're going to bring Alex Madison into the game. Oh, that was almost very nervous time. All right. Less than three to play in the third quarter. And we are going to be handing the rock right here to Alex Madison. Oh, he's got a lane. He has a lane, and he's going to take Jalen Ramsey for a little bit of a ride, and that's going to be a first down. Big, big run for Alex to bring us into, for him to bring us into L.A. Ram territory. All right, here we go. Here we go. Kirk going for the deep ball. J.J., one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, incomplete, incomplete. It was a really weird animation. I don't know if JJ was like pushed in the back or anything, but play's done and over with. By the way, like I said earlier, like I said earlier, and I know it can change at any time, but very quiet game from, from Donald today. That's a good run by Dalvin Cook, and that will take us, it's a 14-yard run. Dalvin sniffing, sniffing 100 yards. He has 82 through almost three quarters. He's having himself a day. All right, here we go. We're going to run a little play action concept here. First and 10 from the Rams, 32. Get the ball right to Madison. There we go. Alex, good run. Good run. Alex keeps going. Oh, get down, get down. I don't want to fumble the ball. Good play. There we go. 15-yard pickup. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Like I said, we've been doing it all year now, keeping teams off balance. They don't know. They don't know what's coming after them. I mean, they don't. They have no clue on each and every play what it could be, and, uh, I like how we've kept everybody off balance, including the Rams today. There's a good run by Dalvin up the middle. Dalvin is inside the five, inside the three, and down to the one. First and goal from the one. They, they are a tired, tired team right now, and you can tell that. Now, I don't want to go. I know that we've had a uh, solid game so far defending Aaron Donald. I don't necessarily want to you know, get in a little you know, goal line formation, Kirk right there, and Kirk gets sacked, I was trying to reach up, and there's a sack for Donald, his first play of the day, um, which Kirk ran directly into him, by the way, but, so it's, you know, it is what it is, oh, Donald's in the zone now, are you kidding, dominant bull rush, longer, all right, whatever, let's just, let's get in the end zone here, guys, let's get in the end zone, let's get in the end zone, let's get in the end zone, Dalvin, 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 he's in the end zone, let's go, 33-20, soon to be 34-20, Dalvin, let's go, that's what I'm talking about. 33-20 could not have came at a better time, and we needed that answer of a drive. That's what I'm talking about. And Greg Joseph, how long was that drive? I know it was a 10-play drive. That's what I'm talking about. McVay is floored. All right, here we go. Let's go, guys. This is critical. Run, run. Asamoah, please. No, Brian, we needed that. Brian, Brian, we needed that. Oh, man, did we need that. They've only ran six times today, and they have 75 yards rushing. That is so, so frustrating. All right, here we go. Fourth quarter. We're up two touchdowns entering the fourth. Oh, no. Oh, no. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, boy. Big play to uh, Cooper. Big play to the man that we just don't want to give up big plays to. I will say he's not having that good of a day. I know that. I know he's not having that good of a day. All right, let's go, guys. We need to just get off the field. I don't care how. Just get off the damn field. Knock the ball out. Knock the ball out, guys. Knock the ball out. Might be a holding penalty. I'd be surprised if it's on us. I'd be very surprised if it's on us. Personal foul, roughing. I want to see this roughing for myself. Let's see. It's going to be on Harrison Phillips. It's, I know I'm pretty sure that's his first penalty all year, so I, I do want to see... Um, I do want to see, let's, let's see what this was here. 
a little ticky tacky, I thought, but that's whatever, man. What are you know? Whatever, it's fine. We're oh boy, there's nine to play. They have the ball in our red zone that quick. I mean that quick. They have the ball in our red zone, and Kendricks can't make the play. Harrison Phillips can't make the play, and now they have second and inches. I mean, guys, make a tackle. I, you know, I've been preaching all year. Literally, just make a tackle. And I knew at some point it would come back to bite us in the ass, and it's looking like it is today. Here we go. Kendricks can't make a tackle. Oh, it's a shocker. Patrick, whoever it was, can't make a tackle either. Touchdown. Make a tackle. You know, I mean, we have the tackle settings on conservative. What, Madden, what more do you want me to do here? Tackle. Come on. Oh, jeez, dude. This is... Oh, man. All right, Kirk. This is why we brought you to Minnesota. I mean, we're still up a touchdown. I, I just feel in a lot of ways that, like, the Rams have all the momentum. Momentum bar shifted officially onto their side. Obviously, we can, you know, we control that. But I'm just frustrated with how good I feel like we've played today. And we're only up by seven. I feel like this is a game where we should be up by a lot more than seven. You know, and I just, that's what frustrates me. And we've been, ran, there you go, the second run defense in the NFL. And we've been running the ball very, very good all day long. Whether it's Dalvin or Alex, we've been, you know, we've been running it down their throat effectively. You know, we've been playing good. And for us to only be up by seven is, it's a little maddening. It's a little maddening. Good run by Alex, really good run by Alex. And I think that is enough for a first down, more than enough. I tell you, Alex is such a good power back. And I'm so glad that we that we reached an extension with him. Because he is such a pivotal part to of the offense. Alright, here we go. Ooh, love this concept here. Love this concept. JJ right there, and that's going to be a gain of four. Five. Gain of five. Alright, here we go, fellas. Seven to play. Second and five. Good, good, oh no, okay, good shoe, good play by Kirk to Irv right there, and that is a big first down, pressure was coming, Kirk, in stressful times, makes a great read, that's what I'm talking about, here we go, under seven for a chance to go to the Super Bowl, there we go, Dalvin, Dalvin, pick, oh, oh boy, that was so close, Dalvin's had a hell of a day, 17 carries, 116 yards, two touchdowns for Mr. Mr. Dalvin Cook on the day, and second and inches, who are we going to give the rock to? Without a doubt, AM2, here he goes, here he goes, just, Alex, I'm bigger than you, I'm faster than you, I'm stronger than you, that's what I'm talking about, down to the 22-yard line. I got to be honest, guys, I'm not going to take the ball out of their hands. I know Kirk's paid an exorbitant amount of money, but we're not taking the ball out of their hands, keep it going, keep it going. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Feed him. And again, it right, met him right in the hole, down to the seven. That's what I'm talking about. Kristen Darisol signaling first down. Don't know if you guys saw it there, but let's go. We're down inside the 10-yard line, less than five to play. Momentum starting to be a lot more in our favor. Dalvin Cook, can he get his third of the day? He's down to the one. Down to the one-yard line for Dalvin Cook. Here we go, guys. This is uh, this is time to step up. Who's going to step up? JJ, best receiver in the NFL. That might send us to the Super Bowl. 40-27. to 27. Jefferson hits the playoff gritty. Third touchdown in two weeks. That's what I'm talking about. What a drive from the Vikings when they needed it most. Four minutes to play, and Greg Joseph kicks us to a 41-27 game. Nine plays, 74 yards. Kevin O'Connell in the first game against his uh, former guy he coached under and Sean McVay in the Rams, and it's looking to go in the in the Rooks' favor. Less than 420, nice to play. Let's go. Still spotlight in Cooper Cup. There is no doubt about that. No doubt about that. Cooper can burn us for Cooper can burn us anytime. I'm gonna use her to kneel here, see if we can get in the backfield. And we cannot. Man, but Harrison Smith's right there. Can we make a tackle? Oh no, Harrison gets you know, I'm just gonna be like, ugh, ugh, right in the middle of an animation and then just boom. Anyway, we got him down. 
Second and six. I'm fine, by the way. Giving up those four-yard plays to Cam Akers. Do it again, Stafford. Do it again. Do it again. Come on, come on. There we hey, we'll take it. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Even 11, that's fine. Tick, tick, tick. Let it go. McVay, I'm not sure why you're clapping, buddy. That's another 30 seconds off the clock. Another 30. Yep, keep running the motion play. Or, no, that wasn't a motion play. That was an audible. But still, keep keep running them. Let's go. Because we're going to get we're gonna get in the backfield one of these times. We're going to get in the backfield. Oh, boy, that's that was a bad angle by Lewis Seen. Okay, anyway, there was 17. Don't, don't like giving up the 17-yard plays. Um, but I don't mind giving up, you know, the 4, the 5s, the 10s. Oh, Lewis Seen almost poked that ball out. We well, should be down to the two-minute warning, by the way. There it is. He's not going to get it off, right? No shot. Let's go. Two-minute warning. Okay. I mean, this is the Rams keep messing around. By the way, I don't know if you guys noticed, but... You know, it's a little chillier now that we're in late October, so I kind of got, like, the Bill Belichick shirt on, if you will. You know, the, the, the cut-off sleeves, but it's actually not cut-off sleeves. Under Armour makes them like this very comfy. But anyway, no free shout-outs, but let's go. Let's go. Come on. Oh, Daniil. Kendrick's right there. Perfect. Perfect. Eight yards. Yep. Keep taking your, take, take your grand old time. Take your grand old time, guys. Oh, my goodness. Even better. Even better. Let's go. Three yards. Another 20 seconds. Keep taking your time, guys. Come on. Come on. Oh, no, 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 not that, not Go on, Sam. Yo, let's go. Tick, tick, tick. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. I want to be in coverage. I want to be in coverage. I want to be in coverage. He's going to go right in the back of the end zone. He's going to go right in the back of the end zone. Oh my gosh, this is a long play. Holy cow. Holy cow, he still might not get in. Oh my god. This is unreal. I just want to be in coverage. Holy cow. This is insane. Oh. Oh my goodness. Whoa. This is absolutely just unreal. Just piss poor clock management by the Rams. Okay, I swear I was right there for the interception, but look, whatever, man. I cannot believe there's less than 20 seconds in the game now. I mean, they just messed around and messed around and messed around, and I thought for sure that one play that went like, the one play that went like 12 seconds, I was like, Stafford, just literally just step up, bro, but oh my goodness. All right, guys, one hands team play from KJ or Adam, and we're NFC champs. KJ makes it could play and we have the ball at the 49 i am oh man you know what i'm going to i'm going to do as boring as it sounds i know they're going to call all three timeouts um but we're going to try and pin them inside uh the 10 when we punt this ball i don't know part of me kind of wants to just run the ball with dalvin once so I might do that on third down, but not on first or second. I know there's only going to be 14 seconds left or 13 when we run this play. All right, we're going to do run, run. We're going to do one play here to Dalvin. It's a play that we've used a lot this year. It's a third and 12. They have one timeout left. We're going to run the ball once, just once, one time only. Takes a holding penalty. Okay, so they should decline the holding penalty. And if they don't, then we're going to... Okay, so third and 21. Okay, so they... Okay. They get the ball back with... Nah, it's going to be... I'm, this ball is going to be up in the air for a while. They're going to get... They're going to get the ball back with like four seconds. It's going to be like four seconds left. One second left. Okay, so truly a one shot here. And of course, I'm going to be blitzing with Eric Hendricks as well because I don't want them to, I want four guys rather than three. All right, here we go. Kendricks in the backfield. Kendricks in the backfield. Okay, here we go. Super Bowl or nothing. Let's go, baby. We're going to the Super Bowl. Kevin O'Connell's Minnesota Vikings. Kirk Cousins now three career playoff wins. 
Sean McVay uh, visibly upset. And guys, we're going to the Super Bowl. Kirk Cousins is an NFC champion. Let's go. Embrace debate. Who's better, Cousins or Stafford? Well, we'll have to, uh, maybe that's a more open debate here soon, but 189 rushing yards. Guys absolutely killed it. Um, we just, we played great today. Pat Pete pick six. Can't forget how we started the day. I do want to take a look at the stats. Kirk Cousins, 264 and two. Had the interception that, you know, didn't come back to bite us in the end. Um, but Alex and Dalvin, both big games. JJ, 5 for 57 and a score. Adam, 5 for 100. Uh, Jalen Reger had a huge touchdown catch. I mean, guys, we just, we, Darius Phylon with the sack. Pat Pete had a 55-yard pick six. I do, hold on, I do want to check. Aaron Donald, I'm telling you, he was not in the game today. I mean, he was not there. Donald, I want to say, just had one one tackle all day, and it was on it was the play that Kirk stepped up on. So Kirk, or excuse me, Cooper Cup, six for 77. Hey, look, we're NFC champs. We are NFC champs. Nobody can take that from us. We've scored a hundred points combined in the divisional round of the playoffs and the NFC championship. That's what I'm talking about, man. I mean, look at all, you know, we get a couple attribute upgrades. Let's go, guys. Who are we going to play in the Super Bowl? We're going to have to advance. You know, we're not worried about a little Pro Bowl. That's all I'm saying. Uh, I'll get all this in a minute here. View playoff bracket. Who are we playing? We're playing Denver. They were playing the Denver Broncos. How did this game go? Oh, the Ravens almost made a fourth quarter comeback. Denver was up 30 to 6 at half. They almost had 500 yards of offense each team did. The Ravens held the ball for... Just a little over 30 minutes. I do want to check the quarterback stats. Russ cooked, unlike what we've seen in real life. Russ cooked in this game. 298 yards, four touchdowns. Oh, my goodness. Javante Williams had 21 rushing touchdowns on the year. Tim Patrick is not injured in this series. Uh, like he tore his ACL in real life, so we had 137-3. and three. Uh, Duvernay over 100 for the Ravens. Guys, I am excited for the Super Bowl. Kirk Cousins versus Russell Wilson. All right, guys, how are we going to do? But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, until next time, please like the video, subscribe to the channel. Most importantly, please have a great rest of your day and I'll see you next time. Love you guys.